How's what's it going, going on, player? Great, great. Hey. Hey. With a name like Gig, yeah, you're a player. <laughs> hey, thanks a lot. Hey, so congratulations on this documentary. It's about time, don't you think so? Well, I don't know. It, 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 if someone thinks it's important, then terrific. Uh, if, if, if I certainly wasn't going to uh, do it myself, uh, but you know, it was something that happened that 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 had history involved, sports history in this country, and um, I, you know, you 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 don't you can't. It's really up to demand mm -hmm. what people want to see right and once it was created people were like wow yeah but you're you're, you're in a position because you are part of that history um, people compare you to the Jackie Robinson of race car driving I mean that's that's very significant it is you know you would you would think that it, uh, at where we're at in this country now it wouldn't be uh, that important, but it is, and um, you know, I don't. Uh, my main concern was to win races, right? Whatever else happened after that happened. Now, tell tell us about um, what is going on today compared to what is going on during your time. Has things actually improved? Obviously, you know, times have changed. The only improvement in auto racing has been Formula One. You know, Lewis Hamilton is not African American, but he's 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 uh, black English, and uh, he is absolute superstar, uh, six-time world champion. Formula One is based on not race. Formula One is based on talent and speed. That's all they care about, right? That's all they care about. There's still. Uh, political issues in this country that corporate America that support auto racing have not addressed. Mm -hmm. They have not addressed it and they've got an obligation to address it because uh, there's billions of dollars that are going into their pocket from African Americans and other minorities that want rep uh, representation in the sport. And you got an obligation so get it done. With, with all these adversaries back then, why did you want to stick around? What did you want to prove? Oh, I enjoyed it. I enjoy, I enjoy uh, adversity. I enjoy push. I want, I want to be challenged, right? You know, it, now, nowadays they call it bullying, right? Well, you know, uh, I enjoyed it. Bully me, because I'm going to bully you right back. And what changes do you think there should be today? Well, I, I, without a doubt, there should be uh, representation in, uh, in, in auto racing, in IndyCar, as well as NASCAR. Those are the two big, big uh, championships in this country. Got to be. Got to be. And they're missing the boat on, on, a, on, uh, on, on an audience that uh, just like... The, Tiger Woods is a perfect example. Look at golf has gained since Tiger Woods has uh, been involved in the sport. Huge, huge. Well, um, auto racing will be a second-rate, small-time sport until they get it, get that handle. Now, before I let you go, one of these days, maybe someone will make a, a nice, um, real story rather than a documentary about you. What do you think about that? Well. <laughs> <laughs> There's going to be some fiction in there, right? So, uh, the documentary is non-fiction. Uh, we can, we can get some. There's been some salacious stories that they could pull from. <laughs> well, I guess we'll, we'll find out. Time will tell. Time will tell. Hey, well, thank you right, very man. much. Nice gig. Thanks.